Getting pretty the pose for the 12th and final race. South rider Kathy Hawk brings him out, claiming handicap pacers of one mile, a purse of $3,500. Win place show exact to trifecta, superfecta, wagering a driver's change on the seven bold item, Jeff Fout. The one is Hammer and Dan, owned by Ronald Ross of Staffordsville, Kentucky, trained by Jeff Brewer. Jason Brewer is out. The two is Gigabyte Bluegrass, owned by Daniel Stone of Lebanon, Ohio, trained by Eddie Pulling, Dave Hawk. The three is Bearcat Hanover, owned by Roy Swainy of Spring Valley, Ohio, trained by David Loff with Jim. Jim Daly, the four is GP's El Cid, owned by Gail Potter of Bucerus, Ohio, and Claudia Peters of Delaware, Ohio, trained by Red Hot Ron Potter, Danny Noble. Number five is Hurricane Sam, owned by Luther and Olivia Dreamstables, both of the Buckeye State, trained by John Robinson, Justin Hall. The six is Napoleon Sabra, owned by Michael Wetter, Middletown, Ohio, trained and driven by Jack Daly. The seven is Bold Item, owned by Deb and Jim Shrake of Londonville, Ohio, trained by Jonathan Winger, Jeff Fout, and from the outside of the eight is TYR Bluegrass, owned by Michelle Omer of Galloway, Ohio, trained by Bradley Omer. Bob Harper is in the sulky. That's the field for the 12th and final race, claiming handicap pacers. Lined up behind the starting gate for tonight's 12th race, the finale. They move on to the back stretch, ready for the start. Field sent on their way in the middle of the track. GP's El Cid leaving well. On the inside, there goes Bear, Bearcat Hanover on the far outside. There goes TYR Bluegrass. Horses stack three wide into the first turn. Bearcat Hanover benefits from the inside. Up on the outside, GP's El Cid. TYR Bluegrass looks to duck in fourth. Along the inside, racing in third. There is, Bear, is Gigabyte Bluegrass. They approach at the opening quarter mile marker. It's Jim Daly and Bearcat Hanover off the opening quarter. 27 seconds flat. They move into the stretch. For the first time, Bearcat Hanover leading the way, racing in second on the inside. Gigabyte Bluegrass, an early move from TYR Bluegrass, relegated to fourth is GP's El Cid, followed by Hammer and Dan, Napoleon Sabra. Moving, th moving to the outside, Hurricane Sam. Behind that one comes Bold Item. The clubhouse turn, the final time on the outside. TYR Bluegrass being used hard here, has not yet cleared. Along the inside, Bearcat Hanover racing along the inside. They come to the half mile marker. Bearcat Hanover regains a, sl regains a slim lead off the half in 56 and 2. They curve into the back stretch. Bearcat Hanover still duking it out with TYR Bluegrass. Gigablight Bluegrass racing in third along the inside. Comes GP's El Cid moving to the outside as they approach the three quarter mile marker is Hammer and Dan. Along the inside, Napoleon Sabra. The paces are bunching, approaching the three quarter mile marker. It's still Bearcat Hanover leading the way. TYR Bluegrass still on the outside is second. Along the inside, Gigablight Group Bluegrass is third. Three quarters, 126 and two into the far turn. Jim Daly steps on the gas with Bearcat Hanover. He opens up a length and a half lead, but Gigabyte Bluegrass looms the danger in the pocket along the inside. GP's El Cid will need a racing room. Top of the stretch, Bearcat Hanover sets sail for home on a two length lead. Gigabyte Bluegrass been tracking that one since the beginning of second. On the outside, GP's El Cid is third in deep stretch. Bearcat Hanover, Gigabyte Bluegrass, but it's it, and that's that. Bearcat Hanover wins it. Gigabyte Bluegrass was second. GP's El Cid was third. Might have been Napoleon Sabra fourth. 155, four fifths. Track side of the winner's circle, the official winner of the 12th race, the three Bearcat Hanover, an eight year old bay goading by Albatross out of a Behave Hanover. She by Tyler B. Is owned by Roy Swainy of Spring Valley, Ohio, trained by David Hoff, with nicely handled here this evening by winning driver Jim Daly. Home a winner at 155 and four, the three Bearcat Hanover takes the finale.